dear students. My name is Yekaterina Kazachenka. I am an English language teacher. Welcome to the English language lesson. So, today we are going to speak about past simple tense. Our lesson is focused today on past simple positive, negative and question forms. Also, today we will speak about reality shows. What are reality shows, guys? Reality show is a television program about ordinary people who are filmed in real situations. What reality shows do you know? Look at the examples. Right, it's Master Chef Junior or The Voice Kids or very popular program in Russia, the best of all, лучше всех. Now, look please at this TV show. This TV show is very popular in the USA. It is called Kid Nation. Please, read the text about this TV show and complete the sentences below the text with missing verbs from the text. For this exercise, you have one minute. Now, let's check. Look at sentence number one. Cameras followed them everywhere. Sentence number two. The group chose the person. Sentence number three. Did the young people enjoy the experience? Sentence number four. Because they didn't like it. Well done. Now let's look at past simple tense. Read the sentence, please. Kid Nation TV show started in 2007. Is this sentence about the past, the present or the future? Right. This sentence is about the past because now is 2020. So, to form past simple, we use subject Kid Nation TV show and verb started uh, in the second form or with endings ed. Once again, subject plus irregular verb in the second form and if the verb is regular, we add ending ed. Look again at the sentences from our text. Look at sentence number one and number two. Cameras followed them everywhere. Followed is regular verb. So, to make positive sentence, we use subject, camera, and then verb followed with ending ed. The second sentence, the group chose this person. Chose is irregular verb, so we use its second form. The group chose this person, subject plus uh, verb form number two. Look please at sentence number four, because they didn't like it. This sentence is negative, so to make negative sentence, 
we use subject with verb didn't and then we use verb form number one. Subject didn't verb in the first form. Look please at sentence number three. Did the young people enjoy the experience? This is a question. So, to make a question, we put our did before the subject and then use main verb in the first form. Did plus subject plus first form of the verb. Well done! Now let's practice. Now let's practice. Look at exercise number one. Complete the sentences with the correct form of the past simple verbs in brackets. You have three minutes. Now let's check. Sentence number one. Take. Take is irregular verb. The first sentence is positive, so I need to put take into the second form. He took part in a reality show. Second sentence is negative, so I need to put verb C into the past negative form. They didn't see the end of the program. Third sentence is positive. Win is irregular verb, so I put win into the second form. She won a million tench on a TV show. Sentence number four is question. So, to make a question, I put did before the subject and use verb into the first form. Did you watch the football match yesterday? Sentence number five is negative. I need to put verb like into negative past simple form. We didn't like the new series on Первый канал. Sentence number six is question again. And again, I put did before the subject. When did the program start? Sentence number seven is positive. Make is irregular verb, so I put it into the second form. I made a film of my friends on holiday. Well done! Now let's look at verb to be. We know that forms am, is, are are the first form of the verb and we use them when we speak about present. Was for singular and were for plural are the second form of the verb be and we use was and were to speak about the past. Now Let's practice. Look at the exercise. Your task is to choose the correct words. For this task you have two minutes.
Now let's check. Look at the sentence number one. We is plural, so we should say we were lucky. Next, two more episodes. Two more episodes is plural noun, so we should put there were two more episodes on the DVD. Well done! Look at sentence number two. Camera is singular, so we should circle was. Where was your camera? Sentence number three. Mark is singular, so we should say Mark was tired, so he didn't watch the end of the show. Sentence number four. Good programs is plural noun, so we should say were. Were there any good programs on TV last night? Look at sentence number five. The first episode is singular, so we should say the first episode wasn't in 2009. It is singular, so we should circle was. It was in 2010. Well done! Now let's practice more. Your task is to write these sentences and use the affirmative, negative or question forms of was, were. Look at the example. I at school this morning. We see that this sentence is negative, so I is singular. That's why we should put was in negative form. I wasn't at school this morning. For four sentences, you have three minutes. Now let's check. Look at sentence number one. We see that this sentence is positive. Two channels is plural noun, so we should put were. There were two channels without adverts. Look at sentence number two. This sentence is question. Look at the subject. A new character. It's singular, so we put was before the subject to ask the question. Was there a new character in the show this week? Sentence number three. You is always plural, so we put were before the subject. Were you in the audience? Sentence number four is negative. Look at the subject. A new presenter. This noun is singular, so we put was into negative form. There wasn't a new presenter in this series. Well done. Good job. Now look please at this gentleman. Do you know him? Of course you do. He is known as Carrot Man. Now, please complete the text with the past simple form of the verbs in the box. Finish, be, broadcast, become, sing, enter, not win, sing, amaze, laugh. This text is about Carrot Man. You have three minutes.
Now let's check. In most reality shows, the participants are ordinary people, but Kairat Primberdiev, also known as Kairat Man, was famous in Kyrgyzstan even before he entered the popular Russian TV talent shows Glavnaya Sena and The Voice, both broadcast in 2016. In The Voice, Kairat impressed the judges and the public in the blind auditions with an incredible version of the James Brown soul classic It's a Man's World. In the next round, the viewers loved it when he sang the Michael Jackson song Black or White. And in the knockout round, he amazed everyone again by singing Tina Turner's Simply the Best. Unfortunately, he didn't win the final, but still finished third with his performance of the song Trouble. Back in his home country of Kyrgyzstan, Kairat Man was a judge on Asman TV talent show. And now let's see what we have learned today. Today we have revised past simple tense. We have learned that to put sentence into past tense, we should use regular verb with ending ed and irregular verb in the second form. If there is no main verb, we should use was for singular and were for plural nouns. They are the second form of verb be. Thank you for your attention. That's all for today. Thank you very much. See you next time. Goodbye.